There's something unique about this project. From an architectural point of view, it doesn't look very, like much. King Okuma took an old warehouse and in 2015 turned it into a shop. But for Tokyo, this repurposing is pretty rare. Here on Google Street View, you can see the building in its pre-refurbished condition around 2009. From a construction point of view, it almost makes no sense. Renovating a decaying old structure and bringing it up to structural code means it would have been cheaper just to tear it down and rebuild a new structure. But the bold move was either made by Kuma or by the client to remodel this building and to keep its old corrugated panels and roofs. Even the trees are kept. I'm repeating myself, but this kind of renovation project is pretty rare for Tokyo. The main visible addition to the project is this wooden stair, which in my eyes looks more like a topographical feature. Its carefully designed steps raises up to the ground floor and continues into another wide stair that gives access to the second floor. The wood flooring has weathered rather nicely and matches the grey colour of the corrugated wall cladding. The ground floor is opened up with new full height windows having been inserted on the street side bringing in a lot of natural light into the interior. The interior has kept its industrial character with its polished concrete floor, exposed steel column and beam structure and open ceiling, all painted white. The walls and ceiling are reclad in wood cement boards, lightly stained, a material that has made its comeback since the late 1970s and which I personally like very much and have used in many of our own projects as well. So in conclusion, this is one of Kengo Kuma's more restrained projects. And I really think we should have more renovation projects in Tokyo rather than scrap and build that we see all around us.